We've got the new FMS Ranger in. So this is new from FMS. It's a 12, 20 mil high wing trainer, uh, ready to fly and plug and play. At the moment, we've just got the ready to flies in stock. Um, it also has the reflex um, stabilization system. So we'll read into that once we get it into the build process. But for now, let's get the unboxing and see what's inside. Here, so we have a one one piece wing. Okay, we have the fuselage there, prop already installed, battery compartment up the front there. We have the reflex stabilization unit down here. Obviously, it's a ready to fly, so the receiver's in there as well. Uh, we'll look into the um, how the actual reflex works. In the, um, in the assembly video, on the flight video as well. So in the box we get the 1300 milliamp 3S. Also in the ready to fly kit you get the charger. We have our elevator assembly. You get the FMS float set. So you can turn it into a um, water plane as well. We have our float wires. If you look back on our previous videos, we went through the different modes. This is a mode 2. We won't fly on this radio, we'll fly on a different radio, but this is the radio you get in the ready to fly kit. We have our hardware bag, and we've got our undercarriage, and your manual. Alright, so I've cleaned the, uh, the box away. The first thing you notice about this new plane is this um, fancy front wheel. Now, for beginners, this makes it really easy, because if you're coming into land, you can virtually bend it right back, um, even sideways, forwards. So if your landings aren't quite 100% yet, um, you're not gonna break that front wheel off straight away and then damage the front prop or the aircraft. So that's a really good way to do things. So for a beginner, that's a great achievement there. I think in the in the, in the flight video, we'll, um, we'll see if we can get the brain to sort of switch off a bit, and <laughs> try and get, this to work a bit and try and get it on film as well. Another thing is, this is the first time I've seen FMS with the stabilizer. I'm not sure how it's gonna sort of react or play. I have flown planes with stabilizers before. So we'll see how that goes as well in the flight. Uh, we'll see if we can turn it off as well, see how it flies with it turned off as well as on. I did read something about a stability. We'll see how that goes as well, we'll look into that. Apart from that, it looks like a great little small aircraft that you can easily put into the back of your car. We'll also test that. We'll try and put it in the car with, with the wings on and, and see if people can get it in their standard car. So after this video, we will we'll do a build video on this plane just to go through how easy it is to put together from scratch. If we find any tips and tricks on the way, we'll, we'll let you know as well. And then we'll organize to do a flight video and chase video for you guys so you can see it flying. We'll try and put the footage of the stabilizer turned on and off and try and overlap and see if you can see a difference. And just get a feel of it that way. So stay tuned for those two videos coming up. Cheers.